Hey guys, in this video we're going to be checking out the Omnibus F4 Pro V2 and this is a pretty uh, packed board with a lot of features as you can see here, uh, you got, it's got a bunch of micro connectors on here so and not a whole lot of things are labeled so I'll have to show you the uh, pinout diagrams this is an F4 processor, it's, it's got the um, Betaflight OSD right back here, so really easy to configure your OSD uh, it's got a really big uh, 5 volt 3 amp uh, voltage regulator on here and you've also got a micro SD card here for your black box logging um, wow well, it's got a ton of stuff here and it's also got a current sensor as well so you can hook this up to your PDB and you're going to get your current uh, values as well as your voltage in your OSD so that's another great feature okay so let's just go over what's on the board here and I'm showing the pinout diagram. You got your USB port, you got your spectrum port here. Uh, on this one here, you got uh, looks like uh, UARTs uh, 3 and 6 and uh, SCL SDA. And then over here, it looks like you've got some additional programming ports, uh, probably not used for much. And then on this one over here on the left, that's going to be your UART 1 for your microconnector. And of course you've got your current sensor right there and your uh, gyro. And as you see on the pinouts here, you got your uh, video in, video out for your OSD over here. Uh, you got your PWM uh, inputs here for your ESCs if you want to direct solder. And then you got also um, the connection for your receiver, it says SBUS PPM. Now if you're using IBUS, uh, because the signal's inverted, uh, you're going to have to use a different UARTs or probably, uh, let's see here, so, your 3 receive 3 over here on this micro connector if you want to connect up your IBUS receiver here and that's probably what I'll be doing okay and so this is the other side of the board you got your micro SD card for your black box I believe this is a a 6 pin connector if you want to connect this to your 4 in 1 ESC so you got your 4 ESC signal outputs plus 5 volt on ground that'll go directly into uh, your 4 in 1 ESCs if you don't want to solder and then over on this side, you got your connector for your LED strip. So this doesn't come with any of the micro connectors. This is a bare board, uh, so something to keep in mind. And uh, it does come with pin headers, but uh, I don't usually use these anyway. Uh, so if you don't have micro connectors for these various components, usually the components that go into this will have the micro connector with it. That's probably why they don't include the micro connectors with the board itself. But if you are lacking those, then you, you'll probably have to go and source those from Banggood or eBay and such. If you uh, are wondering where to get some of those, let me know and I'll try and answer those in the comments section. So this board came with uh, the Real ACC D215 uh, kit and uh, that's the D-Quads Obsession clone. So I'll be building that out with on, on that particular frame and I'll be taking advantage of the current sensor on that. That'll be pretty useful for some battery testing down the road. Anyway guys, just a quick look at the Omnibus F4 Pro V2. Let me know if you guys have any questions about this, and I'll talk to you guys in the next video.